In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Father, we continue to receive your radiance, your fatherhood, your love. Thank you for the Good Shepherd, Father Jesus, here in the Eucharist with us now. Thank you for the gift of these healing prayer time. And Father, as we pray, radiate into every part of our personhood. Radiate not just into us here, watching it through our entire family tree and family bloodline. Let the blood of Jesus, the Good Shepherd, inebriate us, fill us, and move throughout our entire family tree. Jesus, I trust in you. Jesus, I trust in you. Jesus, I trust in you. The Lord is my shepherd, you shall not want. Jesus, you are the treasure of the Father. You know and care about our deepest needs, Lord. Nothing escapes your heart. You see and know every detail of who I am. If I fly to the heavens, you are there. If I am in the depths of shoulder, you are there. There is no darkness that is dark to you because you are light. You are the light in the darkness. In you, Lord, I shall not want. Forgive me for wanting things, wanting people. Forgive me for trying to control my life. Forgive me for not asking you what you want. Forgive me for running ahead of you, O God. You are my shepherd and I shall not want. You want to lead me, Lord, to the green pasture. So I pray for humility. I pray for surrender to always allow you be a part of my decision making. I invite you, Jesus. Help me to do your will. Come into every decision I make with my will. Not my will, but your will be done in every decision I make. Lord, you are... You're my strength and my resource in every challenge that I face. You provide for me. You provide everything I need you may not give me everything I want, but you give me everything I need. And Lord, I want to know you as the answer to every question I have. My heart asks questions. You are the answer, Jesus. Forgive me for thinking there's other answers. You are the way, the truth, and the life. No one can go to you, Father, except through Jesus, your Son here, my Lord and my Savior, our King and our God, the Alpha, the Omega, the first and the last. You are my response in every situation, Lord. I look to you, Jesus, for everything I need in work, in play, in relationships, every dimension in my life. Jesus, please help me. Jesus, you are the visible image of God the Father.
in your wisdom you bring clarity to my life Lord you are the light in my darkness you're my integrity and strength in times of temptation Jesus, we're tempted every day in so many ways. It's so easy to just forget you, Lord. It's so easy to be so busy with life and even with family and work and situations. It's easy to run ahead of you to see our time with you as just a little bit and then we run off and do our own thing. Please, Lord, give us the gift of prayer throughout our whole day that you can supply oxygen to our souls all day long. That you can supply life and love, faith, hope, love, virtues. Come to my aid, Jesus, in this time where I need you. Come to my aid in times of temptation, in times of virtue, in times of vice. Jesus, be my all in all. I trust you to provide, Lord. We pray, give us this day our daily bread. You are my daily bread, Jesus. You are my sustenance. You are my food. You are the bread of life. Unless you eat my flesh and drink my blood, you said, Lord, you have no life in you. Live your life through my flesh, Lord Jesus, through my body, through my mind. Look through my eyes as you live in my soul. Listen through my ears as you listen to the Father through my ears. Feel through my feelings as you laugh, as you cry, as you weep. Suffer even my anxieties and stresses with me as you did so in the Garden of Gethsemane, Jesus. Live your passion in me. Live your resurrection in me. I give you every organ of my body, Lord. Heal every organ of my body. Most especially heal our hearts and our minds. That we may love, that we may choose to do your will. I ask all the saints represented by all the relics here on this altar to pray for us as we pray together these healing prayers. O saints of God, pray for us. Blessed Mother, place your hands upon us and pray over us right now that the Lord will be our shepherd, that we'll let him be our shepherd, and that we shall not want, that we let him lead us to the green pastures of contemplative prayer, healing prayer, healing praise. Come Holy Spirit. I trust you with my health. I trust you with my finances. I trust you with my family. I trust you as my friend. You're more than a friend, Lord. You're the love of our lives. You're our first love. Forgive us for all the ways we have forgotten you as our first love. Forgive us, Lord, for expecting more of our spouses than they can give us. Forgive us for wanting our spouses to be you when you are you. Forgive us for expecting our children to be more than they can be. Forgive us for, forget, for expecting our government leaders to be more than they can be. We've made many idols, Lord, many false gods. We repent today, here and now, in the name of Jesus. I renounce any idols I've made of peoples, persons, governments, markets, material goods, health. I repent of any idols I've made of entertainment. O oh Lord, please help us as a nation so addicted to screen time, so addicted to entertainment, so addicted to media, 
so addicted to food and drugs and alcohol and sex. Lord, we are so addicted as a society. We are a people who walk in darkness, who need you to be our great light. You've come. You send your mother, our mother Mary, all over the face of the earth. She appears in so many places calling us back as her dear children to you, Jesus. And so today I choose you, Jesus. Today I choose Jesus as my Lord and Savior here and now today. I choose you, Lord. I accept you as you so accept me. And Lord, I often want to be perfect, but you won't allow me. Because you want me to learn how to love myself as you love me. If you were to take all my weakness away, you would do me more harm than good. Because I would believe that I'm loved because I've earned it, because I'm perfect. But first you wish to teach me how to love myself, broken, weak, and poor. So Jesus, I abandon myself to you in that state of poverty right now. I lie open before you, poor, broken, and weak. Have mercy on me, a sinner. Have mercy on me. Forgive me for self-hatred, self-rejection. Forgive me for any self-inflicted curses I've put on my life. In the name of Jesus, I break any self-inflicted curses or death wishes off of my life. In the name of Jesus, I break every self-inflicted curse and death wish off my life. In the name of Jesus, I break every curse, self-inflicted curse or death wish off my life. In Jesus' name, Father, bless me. Fill me with heaven's truth about who I am and why I'm here on earth right now. In the short time that I'm here, in this temporal time of my existence here on earth, please don't let me waste a moment of it. Let me use every moment becoming your saint by your grace. I boast in my weakness. Your powers made perfect in my weakness. And Lord, St. Paul prayed three times, take this thorn from my side, and you said no. And Lord, we often pray that you'll take our weakness away, and you sometimes say no because you want us to learn to love ourselves. How can we love our neighbor if we can't even love ourselves? Heal us of anything that keeps us from embracing and loving ourselves and seeing ourselves as gift. In Jesus' name, I break off of my life any ideas that were communicated to me that I'm a burden, that I'm no good, that I'm not good enough. In Jesus' name, I renounce these lies from hell. Father, you infused our immortal soul into our mother's womb at the moment of conception. Our souls came directly from you. And we want to be with you. When we're birthed into this world, so often, Lord, we are looking for love in so many places and faces. You are the holy face. You are the love that we long for. Jesus, be the love of my life. Jesus, be the love of my life. Jesus, be the love of my life. Lord, may our union with you be so total and complete 
that my response to every challenge is simply, Jesus, how do you want me to respond to this challenge? Let that be so natural every day, Lord. Jesus, how did you feel about that? Jesus, how do you want me to respond to this challenge when it comes to me? Jesus, how should I feel about that situation? Jesus, I trust in you. Let that be my cry from my heart from every need I have. Jesus, I trust in you. I pray to experience your divine nature, your human nature. You are a divine person, the beautiful human nature. How beautiful it is, how lovely and good it is that you came to dwell among us, waiting for us in every tabernacle for a visit, a glance, a look of love. Oh Jesus, forgive me for the ways I have not let you be the center of my life. How you long to lock eyes with me, Jesus, to look into my soul that you created, and how you long that I see in your eyes the love you have for me. Look into my eyes now, Jesus. We gaze upon you in the Holy Eucharist. Come, Holy Spirit. Radiate into me new life through your eyes, Jesus. I give you permission to look into me as I look into you. Calm the storm. Form me, Jesus, as I trust you and look into your eyes. Form me to trust you more. May I know you in every moment, rely on you in every circumstance. And may I always remember that I belong to you. I've been purchased by you. And it is your work and job to take care of me and my family. It's not my job first, it is your job first. I'm called to be your little child. Blessed Mother, every time you appear in the different many places you appear, you always say, dear little children. I sometimes think we forget, Mother, how little we are, how powerless we are. No matter how old we are, how well off we are, we are still mere little children that can't turn a hair white or gray, that can't breathe without heaven's help, that can't walk without heaven's help. So totally, utterly dependent upon you. And yet so often deluded into thinking we are doing what we do, as if we claim what belongs to you, Lord. To you be all glory. To you be all the praise. To you be all the honor. Forgive us for claiming glory that doesn't belong to us. Forgive us for claiming money that doesn't belong to us. The money we have you've given us to use for the building of your kingdom, not for selfish gain. Forgive me, Jesus, for using money for selfish gain, for selfish glory, for selfishness. Forgive me for not using my resources for the building up of your kingdom, O oh God. Please, God, I repent. Give me greater, deeper sorrow and repentance, contrition for grieving you, my God. 
Now is the time of salvation. Now is the time. Holy Spirit, transform me that I may use every breath, every beat in my heart, every resource I've been given by heaven for the building up of the kingdom of God to set the world ablaze that souls may know you through the way I love with my resources, that souls may know you by the way I love, by the way I behave and act. I long to know more of you, Jesus. Reveal yourself more to me. I want to believe more in you. Abandon myself to your divine providence, O bread of life. I come to you, Lord, and you promise that I'll never go hungry if I come to you. And if I believe in you, I'll never be thirsty. O oh, living God of peace, great shepherd of the sheep, you equip me with every good and for doing your will. And may you work in me what is pleasing. Through Jesus Christ be glory forever and ever. Make your grace abound in me, Lord, so that in all things and all times, having all I need in you, that I will abound in every good work to the praise of your glory. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.